Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Science here. I hope everybody's well. So, Cancer, it's time for your October round two. This one's a little bit different. Try not a new spread this set. If y'all don't like it, I won't do it after this set ever again. But if it is received well, I might keep doing it like this. So, either way. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. That's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, if you're doing it at mine, or it's thrown down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay too. You can check your Moon, Rising, or Venus sign readings. If you think you might want something that might resonate a little bit better, just keep in mind. Time and energy are both fluid. All things can and be vice versa. It might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. Even though this really isn't a cross watcher's read, I'm not going to lie. Because in this spread, we talk more about you and your strengths and weaknesses, what you need to do to get what you want, to get the outcome that you want. Okay? <laughs> but if a cross watcher can take something out of it, that's super awesome. Either way, everybody's always welcome at my table, and I appreciate everybody stopping by. So, if you're new, I think we're going to vibe. You can hit the subscribe button and the notification bell if you haven't already. That's super awesome if you, if you could do that. Um, if you are returning. Thanks for coming back. I appreciate it. Anybody can hit the like button at any time. It all helps the channel. It is all greatly appreciated and it helps the video to be circulated to those who might need the message. So before I invoke the cards and throw them down, there's two more things we got to go over. One, never make a life altering decision based on a tarot reading. I don't care whose cards they are, mine or somebody else's. And two, if it's not your message on the table, leave the cards in the table and walk away. It's that simple. Okay. Heavenly Father, Mother, Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, I ask you for any messages you have for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, for whatever's left of October. I appreciate you. I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given, and I ask that you help me use it to clearly and accurately bring Cancer to their highest possible spiritual good, put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Cancer, what's up? The Hanging Man. Are you stuck? Somebody might be a little stuck. Somebody might be breaking the chains, but it feels very stuck. All right, what is your strengths? King of Swords reversed. I'm not seeing how that's a strength. How can be hot, being hot-headed and emotional be a strength? We'll go over that in a second. What's your weakness? High Priestess reversed. Never going with your gut? Really? Never using your intuition? It could mean ego. Having an overblown ego can definitely be a weakness. Alright, what do you want out of this situation? Empress, you want growth. This could be someone you want to marry. This, that's like that's like the significant other card. That's the one you have kids with. That's the one you build a home with. All right, what do you got to do? Five of Pentacles are first. Apparently, you got to come out of the cold from somebody. Maybe that's why you're stuck. Somebody dip out on you. What's coming in? Two of Swords, an impossible choice, an impossible decision. What do you got to do? Emperor, regain control. Outcome. Seven of Swords, reverse. Somebody coming clean with the truth about something. All right, let's get a little clarity. One on the hanged man, please. Oh! Two of wands decided to fly out in the reverse. Can't make a decision. Stuck the crossroads. You hung up. I'm not beating that dead horse anymore. Why is the king of swords reversed here? Four of pentacles. You ain't moving. Your strength is your inability to bend. You're not letting go. What are you not letting go of? 
What are you not letting go of? Ace of Wands reversed. Not letting go of something that didn't happen in the past. Not letting go of something that didn't get started. Possibly have a bad attitude toward it. How is this a strength? Karma. Resurrection. King of Pentacles. That's someone willing and able to put work in. That's someone who can back it up. You're not bending. You want to resurrect something that you couldn't let go of. Hmm. Hmm. Why is the High Priestess here for the weaknesses? Why is the High Priestess here for weaknesses? Why the High Priestess reversed for weaknesses? Queen of Cups. King of Cups. Oh my. Knight of Pentacles. I'm a little drowsy all of a sudden. Hmm. I need to grab the sage bowl. Excuse me a moment. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, I had to walk around and take a breather. Okay, so. Knight of Pentacles. Hmm. In regards to weaknesses, ego. Queen of Cups, King of Cups. The emotions there. It's not necessarily shown or expressed or not shown or expressed in an appropriate way. You know the difference between this guy and this guy? It's the knight. That's the king. For starters. This dude's got it going on. This dude wants to have it going on. It's about the speed at which you get there. Sometimes ego gets in the way of progress. Hmm. All right. Talk to me about this empress. Talk to me about the empress. Hello. Three wands. You want the ship to come back to port. You're waiting. Eight of Swords. Page of Swords.
scroll is the bottom of the deck. It's like you're wrapped up in it. Why the page? Why the page of swords? Ten of cups. You're wrapped up in the what could be. You were happy with this person. You want to be able to tell them. You want to be able to express it. Why is the Five of Pentacles reversed here? Five of Swords and the Nine of Wands. What's gotta go? Self-doubt. Why the Five of Swords? Seven of Cups. Why the Nine of Wands? Page of Pentacles. And open your mouth. You gotta open your mouth. You gotta stand up for what you want. Seven. Why the seven? The world. Why the page? Page of Cups. What's gotta go is this self defeating energy. You gotta stand up for what you want. You gotta open your mouth. You wanna be able to. Why don't you? Why don't you? The Seven of Cups, for me, can represent all the possible outcomes. Why are you lulling over possible outcomes? There's a silence here. It's got to come to an end. you you got to get yourself unstuck here. You've got to get yourself unstuck. The only one with power over this situation is you. You want that ship to come to you? I don't think it's going to come to you. What's coming in? Why is two swords reversed here? Three swords reversed. And to heartbreak. The hermit going inside, deciding what you want to do, ending your own heartbreak. Sometimes you got to go in blind, all in, balls out. I mean, I hate to put it like that, but what do you have to lose? What's gonna? What's the worst that's going to happen? Really, what is the worst that's going to happen? Six of Pentacles. There's an energy match coming in. All you have to do is go inside and decide what you want. All you have to do is take action. Even if it's going in blind. Your strength is, you have the potential to be this. Your weakness is all you see is this. You have all this love to give, but all you see is this. Stop holding yourself back, Cancer. What you got to do? Why is the Emperor here? Why is the Emperor here? High Priestess reversed. King of Wands. Kings. Four Kings. Four Kings. Oh, the Emperor represents all four Kings. There's the fourth King. Oh gosh. Control. Take control of the situation. 
the fool. Jump. Know what you want and go after it. Why is the high priestess reversed here? Why is the high priestess reversed here? The queen of wands. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. You know, the high priestess can represent things unsaid. The inner knowing. I think this is telling you to take control of the situation and open your mouth. This is the potential for a divine union. So much love up here that's not being expressed. That's the weakness. What you got to do is express it. What you got to do is make it move. You got to make it move, Cancer. It's not going to move on its own. It's not going to move on its own. Do something with it. Outcomes. Having a sword. Secrets being told. Ten of Pentacles. Justice. Embracing change, two of pentacles. Eight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck, putting the energy and the work in. Okay, we're getting your advice and we're calling it a read. <sighs> Judgment reversed, eight of pentacles, nothing's going to happen if you don't put in the work and the effort. Six of swords reverse, three of swords. Even if you go back to it, you just get your heart broke again. That way you know. And you can get unstuck. But what's coming in is a potential end to heartbreak. Eight of wands reversed, king of wands. You're not going to make anything happen if you don't open your mouth and say anything. Nothing's going to happen if you don't take action. You want to make it move. you got to be the one to make it move, Cancer. The tower changed lies within you. Okay. I'm going to check out. Know that you loved. Be blessed. I'll catch you guys at your next reading.